Hi everyone, it's Emma from Emma G Marketing. So today I just wanted to do a quick video because there are a couple of new options on your Facebook pages that I just wanted to make you aware of. You possibly have seen them already, so I just wanted to go through one today that might help you in terms of creating new marketing content that can reach out to your potential customers and indeed remind your current customers that you are there and that they can call you and ring you for your product or service. So without further ado, this is my own Facebook page, MD Marketing. And when I want to post something as normal, when I come down here, I can either write something in the status, I can put a photograph or a video, or I, can, or I can create an offer or event. So for today, we're going to create a photo or a video. Now, as of last week, there's a lot more options than you normally had. So as per usual, you can just upload a photo or a video. You can create a photo album. Um, this is great in terms of just putting all the photographs for a particular event or for something specific into one particular folder and it allows viewers to come in and see them rather than going through all of your photographs they can just literally go to the particular album that they're interested in. You can create a photo carousel and basically this is a linking back to your website or indeed to a specific page and creating a series of pictures um, that can scroll along. You're probably, you probably have seen them in Facebook ads in particular. Um, and these would be seen in your main home screen when you're looking. You can also create a slideshow, which is what we're going to do today. And a newer feature is create a canvas, which is all about storytelling, which is really, really cool. And there's massive potential there. But for today, we'll create a slideshow. So I'll click in here. I've already kind of set up my pictures. So I'm just going to randomly select a couple of pictures. We can click up to seven pictures. So I'm just, as I said, randomly going to pick them just for today. See, they're ones I just got done from my website. So they're the easiest one to kind of come across and do something with. And I'm just going right across the board and just uploading oops, a series of photographs. Let's go in here. Do I have one more? I think I do. So we'll just go here. So I'm just randomly picking them. So it takes a couple of moments for each photograph to upload. I do have one more I can pick. So I will go right down to the end. I have no idea what's in any of these, but <laughs> it's part of a photo shoot I did last year for my website. So as you can see, they're all of me, not because I love myself, but I just got them, a variety of them done for my website, some of which I used and more of them which I did not. So if we're to publish this, your video is now processing. We will send you a notification when it is ready to view. So basically, Facebook goes on and it creates the video for you. And then you will get a notification up here, you know, in the normal notification area little red sign will come up and say that your video is now ready. Um, then all you have to do is go back into your Facebook page and you can view it from there and you can share it um, wherever you want to share it. But, you know, creating a little video, creating a slideshow, oh, it's ready there now as I'm talking, is a great way of, you know, creating something that's interesting for people in that it's not just one static picture and it allows them to kind of view you maybe slightly differently, which is great back in here and we'll see what it looks like. Make it slightly slow. So there it is. So it's literally just a slideshow but I, what I would encourage you to do is put a little bit more thought than I did into the pictures um, you know that you have a sequence there that um, it is relevant that you're telling a story and that it is of interest to people. So there you go. Hope that helps. So I'd encourage you all to use slideshows um, in a, as a means of promoting your businesses and letting people know not just through one image but through at least seven, seven images whereby you can demonstrate what it is that you do. So I hope that helps. Let me know in the comments. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and you will see more videos going forward. Thank you.